Hey guys, welcome back for another video review. Today we are looking at a wooden cube digital LED display clock by Perry Lee. I have the clock right here in front of us. Uh, as you can see, as the name suggests, it basically looks like a wooden cube. And one of these sides will act as a display. I'll quickly show you which one. At the back, we have a battery compartment that takes in uh, three AAA size batteries. Alternately, you could also supply USB power to it. So this is the battery compartment for uh, the three AAA size batteries, which act as a backup. And you also have the USB cable included with it. The other end of which is the DC input that can be plugged in right here at the back for it to get power. Uh, there are three buttons at the top of the back side. As you can see, that's the set button right there. Then there's the up and then the down button finally. These help you adjust the various settings on the clock. Now this is going to be the face of the clock. This is where the digital display will come on. And you'll see that as soon as I plug in this cable. There we go showing us the current time. The dot at this corner indicates that it's night, that means it's PM. So when you have the 12 hour format on, a dot here would indicate PM and when there's no dot, it would be AM. You can set it to a different mode where it alternately shows the time, date and temperature. Right now it's set to the static mode where it only shows the time. This clock is also sound activated. So when it's in the power saving mode, if there's a sound of greater than 50 or 60 decibels, it will automatically come on, the screen will come on, and it will show you the time. There's also an alarm function in this clock. You can set up to a total of three alarm clocks that you can optionally turn on or off on the weekends as well. All the settings can be done using the buttons at the back. And there's also an instruction manual included that pretty much explains how to set up this clock. So now I'm going to set this up to the alternate blinking mode using the set button. So now you can see it's on DP1 mode, which basically means the clock is going to be on and then there's going to be the date coming on and then finally the temperature coming on. So it's going to toggle uh, between the clock and the temperature and the date. The clock stays on for the maximum amount of time, then comes the date, and finally the temperature. Now if you press the set button again, it takes you to DP2. And this is the mode where the clock remains on continually, and there's no temperature or date display that comes on. You can flip the time between 12 hour and 24 hour formats as well, so that's another option. Uh, lots of flexibility with this clock. Overall, it's a nice looking clock, very, very lightweight. There's no weight to it. And it goes well with uh, any kind of furniture, if, especially if it's brown or black in color. Uh, you can simply put it on any shelf and it's gonna show you the time. Even in the dark, the LED is bright enough for you to be able to see the time conveniently and it won't disturb your sleep. It's not bright enough to disturb your sleep, but it's clear enough for you to be able to see the time. Um, so that's pretty much about this clock. Uh, I found it very nice looking and very convenient. Um, hope you liked watching this product and hope you enjoyed watching the video. Um, your questions, comments and feedback are always welcome. Uh, thank you for watching.